I'm Jen Sherman. I'm the daughter of Eliza Sherman. And over the past six months, I feel like I have been living my worst nightmare. Life has been a challenge every day, and the pain and suffering, you know, doesn't go away or get any easier. I carry with me a sense of tremendous loss and a hole in my heart that I know will be there forever. I do know that while initially I, you know, hid behind sunglasses and a, a baseball hat, today, six months later, I do feel that I have become stronger and that my enormous bond with my mom and our devotion to one another has given me the courage and strength to fight for her justice and to never give up that fight until justice is served. Over the last six months, I have become extremely close with my brothers Jason and Jeremy. They moved in with um, my fiance Kevin and I. And while they are my family, I have also learned that family does not necessarily mean just blood relatives. A group of about 30 to 35 of my close friends and my mom's close friends have truly become a family. They have been there for us and supported us every step of the way for the last six months. And it's amazing how my mom, although she's not physically here with us, brought together this group of 30 or 35 people. And most people didn't even know each other. And now we've become a family because of my mom. And beyond that, um, we have met so many amazing new people who have reached out to us, some of my mom's patients, um, Yvonne Pointer, and um, some of her friends from the Cleveland community have been wonderful support and have given me a lot of courage. And Yvonne continues to reach out to me and call me, calls me pretty regularly. And it just amazes me, this big community and group of people that have been so supportive and I'm grateful to every one of them.